what's your, I mean, just obvious initial reaction to the game and how it went, you know, first loss in the way? Yeah, very, uh, very tough not, or day, afternoon. Um, you know, they're a good team. Um, you know, I gotta, you got to give them credit. You know, they beat us tonight. Uh, we're not going to sit here and say that, you know, we went and lost the game. Did we play our best? No, absolutely not. But they made more plays than we did. And, um, you know, they came out on top. And credit to them. Does not having Jalen change the looks that you get for some of the other guys, for Jaden or anything else out there? Uh, no, I don't I don't believe. I, I, they did a little bit different uh, scheme than we had seen so far. I mean, we had seen them do it, but they did it more tonight to us. Um, you know, they play well. Um, but no, I mean, I wouldn't say so. Jalen's a great player. Uh, I, love, I love throwing to him, but I trust the guys that we have behind him as well. What did you know? they do that was different? That was, you know? uh, they played a little bit more one high coverage to us. Uh, we were expecting a little bit more two, two high. And, um, you know, they gave it to us a little bit, but they definitely, um, you know, kind of flipped those percentages a little bit, you know, in terms of one to two high. So, uh, but yeah, they play well. You know, they defended us well, and uh, we need to score score more points, you know, and uh, that's, we, didn't, we didn't get it done. Mostly Garn Foster all had pretty good games for you, and I guess what did you see from those, those three guys, particularly the two guys you haven't really used a lot You said it was Mosley, Carr, and Foster, you said? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, they, 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 uh, they didn't necessarily step up, you know. It's just what they've been doing in practice, you know, and that's what they've been doing. And they, and they brought it out here under the game or the game field, and they did that. So, um, you know, it's nothing new to me. You know, I've seen those guys make plays. Obviously, Malik had a good night tonight. He had a few nice catch and runs, nice two point conversion. Montori did what he's been doing, you know. And I trust I trust him moving forward. And I know he's a good player. And then Trey, you know. Uh, had a couple nice touchdowns today. And again, he's, he was doing the same stuff that he's been doing all year. So um, just the coverages, and we're just reading plays and getting the ball to the guys that, based on the defense, are telling us we should get the ball, and that's what happened tonight. After your Jazz time, won. 21, what were the differences after that score? What was that? After the score was tied at 21, what did you see as the differences? Yeah. Um, you know, we went up, we went and scored, or scored and then tied it. And, um, you know, and then we went out, and I think we had two or three, three and outs in a rush that. And, uh, you know, that's not going to get it done, not at all. And uh, so we had, we had to be better there. Uh, we need to get first downs. We need to put ourselves in good situations on third down. We had a couple third and longs. But then it just comes down to execution, and we didn't execute the, the times that we needed to. So um, that's what we'll be looking at on film, and that's what we'll be looking to correct. The fourth down throw to Jaden, far corner, end zone. What yep. did you see? <clears throat> guys checked into that too, right? Or changed the play right before? Uh, we hadn't changed the play. We, we had no play called yet, and then we called the play. Um, you know, he ran out route, and, uh, you know, I put it out there. I need to put it more in front of him, you know, to uh, give it a ball that the defender can't really touch. Uh, I didn't do that, and then the guy made a great play. You know, credit to him, he made a good play. And, uh, you know, can't, can't be turning the ball over on that situation. And, uh, you know, at the end of the day, that's not, that's not going to get it done. So uh, we'll look at that, and we'll be better moving forward. Did James say anything about having possession now? There's some of you. Nah, we didn't really talk about it to be honest on the sideline. I haven't talked to him about it yet. But, um, but yeah, the guy, made, the guy made a really good play. <clears throat> so Jazz Watts, after the game, he, you guys were walking off the field together. He put his arm around you. What did he say to you in that moment um, as you guys were leaving the stadium? Man, to be honest, I don't, even, I don't really remember. Uh, there was a lot, lot going on when we were walking off the field. Uh, Jazz is a great guy. I'm sure he says something, something positive. And, uh, you know, I love having him on our team. I love talking with him. And I'm sure it was something good that he said. But, you know, there was a lot, lot going on during, the, during that time. So I yeah. uh, quite, can't quite remember. Oh, you know, Coach Tucker talks about the 24 hour rule, but how do you kind of process this first loss right now and, and springboard it? Yeah, you know, you look at the rest of our season. Um, you know, we got good opponents in front of us still. We got Maryland at home next week. And yeah, it's a 24 hour rule, you know, win, lose or draw. And, uh, you know, tonight, unfortunately, we were on the, the wrong side of it. And, uh, you know, we're going to go back. We're going to show up tomorrow, uh, get our bodies ready to go for the week in front of us, you know, and uh, the process doesn't change. It's just we take a look at the things we didn't do well, and we're going to go ahead and refine those things, and we're going to be better in the future. You know, this isn't a, uh, a roadblock. This is just something that we got to work through, and we'll take a look at it, and, uh, and, we'll, and we'll get better. Thank you, guys. Thanks. 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 Thanks.